What is up, Eastern Oregon? This is Dodzy, and this is your sports show for Monday, May 24th, 2021. Um, let's see here. We got it's Monday. Let's shake them Mondays off. It's official. My boy Chris Kemp is the interim men's basketball coach at EOU. Kemp, I'm proud of you, man. This team has bought into you, and I, I think it was the, the right hire. And man, so hey, my viewers. I'm going to have Kemp on the show on Wednesday, and we're going to talk about the new basketball culture at EOU. Chris Kemp, new interim men's basketball coach at EOU, on the show Wednesday, 5.30 p.m. Be there. This is all brought to you by Rock and Sons Tire and Auto. East End to Adams and LeGrand. Go see JB and the boys. If you have anything that you need done with your car, go see them. They're trustworthy. I mean, it, it's, a, it's a great place to take your vehicle. Rock and Sons is Tire and Auto, east end of Adams in LeGrand. Sports show wise, today, no guests. Um, we're we're kind of wrapping up the school year here and, and trying to fe- transitioning into basketball and wrestling for on the high school side, but kind of wrapping it up at EOU. So it's just going to be short and sweet today. I want to take time out of the day today to thank some people and 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 outside of sponsors. I mean, obviously the sponsors are what make it go around, but there's also other people that have helped support me in this, in this show. Um, Lee Wright, the right fix. Um, He's a handyman here in town. He's a huge EOU and LHS fan. He comments on everything. He helps when we're doing fundraisers. He's the, he's a go-to dude and he's a stand-up dude and he helps out with anything that's ever asked, you know, or even when things aren't asked, he's there. And he's the spirit of, of what this community kind of reminds me of and, and how we should be towards each other. Also, everybody that cheers me on, like outside of, you know, my, my own personal circle, I appreciate you guys, man. Uh, this, this is a fairly new adventure for me. I'm used to being behind, you know, like behind the scenes and, and, um, being on camera is not always easy. And I appreciate everything that everybody does to, to motivate and to, to just kind of solidify the, the fact that I should be doing this for now. I mean, eventually I'd love to, it to get to the point where I could find somebody to host and I can just be the person that creates but for right now this is how it is baseball and softball this weekend i almost completely forgot um the high school legrand they played um uh in state championship games um well the the softball team played in the third fourth fourth game which was their last game of the season i think they lost that one and then the high school team i was talking to dalton sheets out here earlier and he said it was the championship was one of the best games that they played all year. And it went down to, it was two to one in the bottom of the seventh. We were the visiting team. And uh, unfortunately we lost in the bottom of the seventh, but that's not to take anything away from these kids, man. These kids have been through just, I can't even imagine going through what they've been through sports wise and just life wise with COVID. On top of that, in a state championship game, losing a heartbreaker, man. That hey, let's not take anything away from these boys. Let's lift them up because they had one heck of a year. And hopefully next year looks different and we can, you know, support them even more. Um, another person that I want to thank before I get you guys out of here is uh um Mr. Johnny Mallory, ball game. Um he he uh reached out to me to produce his show. And we had our run together and it was amazing. I mean, we, we were killing it. And then COVID came and we still found a way to make it work. And then the job opportunity came in Boise and he took it and um, he's encouraged me all along. And he's been a huge fan of what I'm doing as well. I mean, I'm, I'm a huge fan of what he's doing as well. He's one of my best friends. And, and I just want to take a second out of my day to, to thank him too, because without him you know i'm not even here right now you know i i i don't know where i would be right now actually so uh ball game thank you i appreciate you you know that i love you um and then just you know with with sports guys if you have something like one of my issues right now with the whole sports thing is is getting information um so 
I'm going to put my email up. It'll be right here. Kyle at EO Live TV. And if there's something breaking and you guys can help me out, email me. Because right now with schedules changing and everything, especially with the high schools, it's really hard for me to, to stay on top of everything by myself. And it's just me doing this. So if if you guys don't mind helping me out with stories, Kyle at EO Live TV. Hey, if, if something changes, you know what I mean? Or if something comes up, email me, message me on Facebook, do whatever. Um, like, share, and subscribe to this. Th that's the other thing that can help outside of supporting the sponsors. Just like, share, subscribe. None of this is possible, like I said again, without Rock and Sons Tire and Auto. JB and the boys, you need your radiator worked on, you need your tires changed, you need a new battery. Go see them. East End of Adams in the Grand, Rock and Sons Tire and Auto. Anyways, that, there's my sports show for today. Not a, Oh, one more thing before I go. Keegan Glenn, who's been on my show, he's a union basketball standout. He signed with uh, BMCC this last week. So congratulations for you, Keegan Glenn. I'm proud of you. Uh, keep up the good work, man. Keep up the good work. Eastern Oregon, that's all I got for you on a Monday. No guests today. Um, I'm going to – I have a new thing coming that I'm working on, so I've been kind of busy with it for Wednesdays. So stay tuned for that. I appreciate you, Eastern Oregon. I'm Dodzy, and I'm out.